Yes. yes. That's the oh. latest thing. Oh, I like this. I've got so many clothes on because my mum's stockings. coming. I feel like stockings on underneath. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna <laughs> suffocate. The three of you are sitting here, totally accepted, looking great. How were you as children? Were you wild as children? Did you? Were you class clowns? Yeah. Were you... I, I was pretty wild, I think. Always. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't picture yeah. that. <laughs> Actually, no, I, I always wanted to be the entertainer because I'm one of seven. So we had to talk really loud and really be... To be noticed. Uh, uh, yeah. What about exactly. you? Small or big family? Yes. I, I mean, I have, I have six brothers. And, but it's really like one brother with six interchangeable heads. Right. You know? <laughs> 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 and, um, and, you know, in my family, we weren't allowed to laugh in the living room, you know. I used to, well, yeah. we, we had to wait until Sunday Mass when the priest asked for money. Yeah, yeah. right. Then. <laughs> yeah, Pop. No, because I, I was raised... No, Joan, I was raised Italian Catholic, so I thought my choices when I grew up were either to be a nun or a gangster. You yeah. know. <laughs> like there's a difference. Yeah. And so... He's a preacher. I mean, You're, you just went to mass. Your you? father's a preacher. How does Excellent. he deal? How does he? My <laughs> daddy and two of my brothers. How do they deal with you? I mean, the look of you. Well, I know you're a good person. A, no, he's not having a heart attack right now. I think because I still have my clothes on. Yeah. What happens <laughs> when you like painted gold and go to a party, and your father sees that the next day in the newspaper? Is he in shock? Uh, no, as long as I have something on, it's okay. Oh, you right. know, yeah, yeah. He just said, just don't take any more off. Please. Does he come and see your performances? Uh, no, no. He goes to church to see, you know, to do his performance. It's, uh, well, it's very yeah. theatrical. Yeah. And what about you? Big family, small family, tell me. Big family, one of seven also. So also, really? Yeah, yeah wow. I'm in the middle. Where are you? I'm, I'm the first girl. You're the first yeah. girl. Me but too. You're in the middle. Oh, yeah, yeah. I have in the to middle. take care of all my big brothers. <laughs> But I had Wait. brothers all around I mean, me, so I'm kind of a tom girl. Three brothers and three sisters. Were you outrageous in school? Were you quiet? Were I any of you a nerd? You know, I'd be really interested to see what my mum has to say about me, because I don't really, I don't really think so. I don't well, think your mum went to school with you? <laughs> well, <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Never wanted to go. I think, so. What about just now? You all and me too, in my own way, because I look like you know Barbara Bush did here today. Like, <laughs> 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 you look fabulous, guys. Oh, it's gorgeous. <laughs> when I was at, when I rebelled, we're all rebellers, is what I'm saying. Mm. Obviously, were you rebelling as children or? I mean, from the beginning, were you great? What about school? Were you wild in your class? <laughs> I, th I didn't think I was wild in my class. I just didn't used to accept a lot. I, I used to be able to do things and do them very well. And so I used to get bored, like if I was in sewing class. You know, I could make an outfit. My talents was I could make my outfits, like, in a, in a couple of hours. And then you used to have to go back, like, each time, you know, to one lesson to finish a skirt that was ended up three times too small for you because by that time you'd grown up, yeah, you know? <laughs> and so I used to get very bored, and that's where I think my... Um, rebellious side came out because I used to get frustrated because I wanted to move a little bit quicker. What about you, Judy? Were you crazy in school? Not no, I, I, was, I was really a petite flower. Oh. You know, I, oh, begging to be pollinated. And, uh, <laughs> no, because, no, because I, I was sent to an all-girls Catholic school, St. Obnoxious in bondage. And, you know, no, but, and I, I did get in trouble, though, once. Um, you know, Sister Godzilla got mad at me because I, I gave her a shaving mug for Father's Day. But, you know, she's like, Judy, it's time for your religion test. Is there life after death? I said, um, look in the mirror. So, yeah. So it worked out good. What, what age did you discover boy? Because you're all very sexy. What age did boys discover you? But what, what age did you discover boys? And which came first? Boys liked you or you liked boys? Boy, I don't remember. <laughs> I'm still waiting. Oh, no, yeah, that, <laughs> nice! No, I, I, I like boys. I did, of course. No, I know, but yeah. at what age yeah, were you wild? About, did you go out, uh, like, sneak out at night? Did you no, I used to sneak out. Cal, no. <laughs> <laughs> what about with men? You're all three single. At what point, and they all see you, everyone meets you, they meet you 
is this persona, mm -hmm. right? Nobody's going to meet you mm -hmm. any other person. When at one point is the persona of downtown Julie Brown, hip, now, trendy, clubs, woo, 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 when, go when away. When do I take these clothes off? Yeah, and just become... <laughs> when I'm with him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not very often. Um, but, uh, with two pairs of underwear, it's getting hard, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. You know the story. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm very much, you know me, Jane, and so I very much, um, you know, with Grace and Judy, they have a certain thing that they have to carry off, like I'm not an actress or a comedian or everything, so my personality is normally what I wear. I don't really change my wardrobe. I mean, I do shower. If I don't, if I have a show the next day, if I have a... Thank God. If, no, if I have um, a show in the morning and I don't want to get my hair wet, like I shower with my bowler hat on. Yeah, all right. And I always wear my Victoria's Secret with my big... Um, combat boots, yeah. and so that, my men see me like that all the time. And what about you? When do you say, this, what is the real you? Is this the <laughs> real, real, real you? Yes, well, I'm... <clears throat> oh, nice. Um, no, yes, well, you know, I try, to, I try to be democratic with all men, because I want to give all the pigs a chance, you yeah. know. So, no, because, well, come on, because I am, I am a love goddess. I know. I and know. I, you know, Joan, and I want all men to think that at some point they can all be my furniture. Yeah. You know, I want <laughs> what about you as a mother? How do you go to your, your, your son's school? It's Parents' Day. Uh, Would well, you show up you in this? You have a toddler? <clears throat> yes, I do. Oh, excellent. I'm really yes, good with yes. toddlers. Not as good as Rob Lowe, but I well, could. <laughs> no, 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 really. It's my, my son actually loves me to dress up, but I did, I, once I had to do a... Uh, a teacher's and parents' race right. for his Olympic day, and I was supposed to bring a jogging outfit. And I came in this, what I thought was really a normal jogging outfit. <laughs> you, know? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was all hooded and kind of, I, I thought it was just perfect. And he went, oh, no, Mom, <laughs> not that, you know. <laughs> I said, it's a jogging outfit. I mean, you know. What, what does he dress up? Is he very conservative? Is he swipping, swipping no, back actually, the other way? No, actually, he, you know, he does the jeans, the jeans number like yeah. all kids because they're rough and everything gets dirty. And uh, he likes leather, you know. Uh, yeah. How old is he going? Hey, he's 10. 10? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, he loves leather and kind of cool-looking yeah. Michael Jackson kind of gear, you know. What about your mothers now? You're all <clears throat> close with your mothers. We found that out already. That's why they've all come on the show today. <laughs> what were the things that you did? They can't hear them in the green room. Oh, Tell me the most outrageous things you can think of you did that your mothers never found out about. Now, I always seem to get caught. I think, you know, even, even if I don't get caught, someone will write an anonymous letter and say, you know, your daughter has been doing this, and I yeah. think you ought to ask her about it, you know? Do you, do you still apologize to your mother for things you do? Oh, no. no. It's way beyond that. No, no. She, <laughs> no. No. I, and I, I was like, like I said, I was like this perfect kid, so I waited until I left home. Uh, and I, I was trying to be an actress, so uh, I, my friend Joyce uh, said, oh, we were in New York City, and she said, oh, I got a, a film role for us. And I was so excited, so we'd go and show up. And um, it, <laughs> it happened to be a porno film. <laughs> no, but I didn't know, Joan. I trust I'm you. I'm confessing now. I trust you. I love guys that have a title, honey. I trust you. <laughs> <laughs> We were supposed to be cute little secretaries with pointed breasts like, uh, you know, Mary Tyler Moore. Right, right. And we go out, and we were supposed to, all we had to do was sigh when our boss walked by, but when our boss walked by, he was like, gay is a $3 bill, you know? So he's like, oh, girls, I need that memo pronto. And, you know, and we were like dying, and so I'm going, oh, you know? Then we go in the bathroom, and there's Linda Lovelace. I go, what are you doing here? She goes, well, I'm, I'm doing a film. I go, how great, so are we. And I go, Wh which one? She goes, oh, Sam Sledge and the Diamond Capers. I go, nice. She goes, oh, don't worry. I'm on the private set with the German Shepherd. <laughs> nice. God. Okay. Perfect. And my mom doesn't know. So, Mom, if you, you know, I, well, I, I'm now. in the separate, yeah, but I'm in the separate <laughs> scenes where I was a secretary. Okay. What about you? Anything that your mother I know? think, you know, my father was probably the strictest one because I'm a, from a, you know, he was in the Royal Air Force, so I'm sort of like one of those brat people. But my mom, I think, always encouraged us to be really individual. She didn't really care. It was always mum that said, Mom, I need a quid, you know, can you give me some money? And she'd always go, 
you know, <laughs> pass it through. Mum was always the one that knew I was sneaking in at four o'clock in the morning, you know. And loved it. And now, keeping Dad happy so that I could... Bless yeah. it. She made just about, you know, she started going, I love you, husband dear, when I started to crawl up the stairs on the uh, way. Isn't that She nice. helped me out a lot, yeah. Well, we're going to bring your mothers out now oh. and find out what they're like. <laughs> We'll be back. We're going to meet the mothers of these three wonderful, outrageous, glamorous ladies. So stay tuned. Say, Judy, I've been a bad pig. Judy, I've been a bad pig. I want basting. I want basting. How good could a fat free cake make you feel?